Yo, 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 what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, The Wolf here, bringing you guys another video today. And uh, today we're going to be diving in on another wallet. This one coming from Civic. Uh, for those of you that are not familiar with Civic, uh, Civic is basically your identity in your hands. Uh, so think of it as an authentic authenticator system, a KYC system. Um, but you'll be able to reuse uh, all these different sign-ins and logins while having to necessarily constantly put in all these different information, um, especially when you're doing you know, all these different KYCs and you know you're trying to uh, what's called enable two-factor authentications. Um, Civic basically controls your identity, your money. Or I should say controls your identity, it protects your identity, it protects your money. And now they just announced that they're actually developing their own wallet. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, did not see that coming. But as you come here, of course, right now they have a wait list and um, I'll drop my link below so you guys can sign up and move up on the wait list. That way you guys can, you know, hopefully get your wallet uh, as soon as possible by moving up the list. But as you can see here, this is the home page and um, Civic wallet, your identity, your money, your choice. Uh, join the next generation identity and payment network where your identity information, money, and crypto live on your device and enable you to transact everywhere privately, securely, and conveniently. Uh, so like I said, you can get early access by joining the wait list. As you can see, it's launching in the fall. And then as you refer your friends and family, you can move up the wait list and start using the Civic wallet. Uh, as you can see here, your identity, uh, only share your identity information with companies you trust. Um, I has advanced ID verification, privacy first, identity and payment. So as you can see there, that's a little uh, pre what the transaction will look like on their wallet. Um, so as you can see, they run face comparison and government issue ID document verification to, sh to ensure that the person getting verified is a real person and to comply with existing regulations. You only have to share the identity information that's needed for the transaction and nothing more. Anonymous age checks, disclosing your nationality and other use cases are now possible. So none of that, you know, okay, what's your age? Where are you from? None of that um, identity and payment, pay and or approve your identity to access age restricted products or get it verified for a financial services product, all while protecting your sensitive information. As you can see, this is what the wall is going to look like. It's going to be easy to store your control, of course, which is always the greatest zero fraud and you can pay with ease. Um, you see, you can join the peace of mind that comes with being able to safely transfer and store your cryptocurrency. You control all of your data and money via your mobile device. Uh, every entry point is dependent on passing advanced identity checks. No more misuse of stolen information. Because uh, if I'm not mistaken, uh, I think there was another data breach either with TransUnion or Capital One. Somebody had another data breach, but um, use the wallet to send and receive crypto from friends and families. Use it to purchase from select merchants. Curious to see which merchants are going to be able to use the Civic Wallet. Um, as you can see here, you come down, uh, you'll be able to bring your own crypto. You can be able to store Bitcoin, Ethereum, uh, looks like Gemini and Civic in your wallet. Uh, you'll be able to pay with crypto at Civic enabled vending machines, huh? Haven't seen a Civic vending machine yet and select vendors, of course, uh, let's see. And looks like you'll be able to fund your wallet with the regular money by verifying connecting a bank account. Uh, trying to think, is there anything else? I think that might wrap it up. Yeah, so that's gonna wrap it up. It looks like it's gonna be all virtual. It looks like there won't be any uh, card that's gonna be, what's the word I'm looking for? A hard copy, I guess to say. So it looks like the their Civic card will be all virtual. So you'll be able to pay everything and do everything on your mobile device, which is always nice. Um, and then you can always restore back up your private keys um, once you get verified once all you have to do is basically uh, do a face check uh, like a face scan so I actually have a civic download on my phone and it's pretty nice um, I use it for certain logins for um, certain places and stuff like that but I also have 
uh, an application called Authy that's pretty similar to a Google authentication. But yeah, so that's gonna wrap up Civic Wallet. As you can see, you know, the fall time, that's gonna be what, I mean, we're pretty close as we get ready to end August, September, October will be here as soon as you know. And hopefully that's when we'll be able to see this bad boy and start getting it to use. But uh, that's going to wrap it up for today. That's going to wrap it up for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. And uh, until next time, y'all, take care.